G'day, I'm Simon Finn from Beyond the Break. Today we're going to hear from the crew from Rig 175, one of the most successful operating crews in the Bass Strait. This crew is well known for their commitment to safety, teamwork, leadership and ongoing successful campaign drilling operations. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Safety is more about than just following policies and procedures. It's, it's very much about people, isn't it? Absolutely. I mean, you guys probably have got the feel of that as you've been around today. It's, we, we're a big family here and we don't want to see any of our boys hurt in any way. You know, and that's what it's about, really. What are the unique challenges you face on a drilling rig? I think, you know, it's a, environmentally we have, you know, we deal with all sorts of different conditions and we work 24-7 really. Very rarely does anything close down up there unless it's really bad weather-wise. That's a big factor, uh, fatigue. We work long shifts, as, as you see when we walk around. Um, it's, a, it's an environment that's full of trip hazards, things to hit, things to knock, it's, everything's very heavy. Yeah, it's a very dangerous environment. Coaching and mentoring plays a huge role out here, in particular with neighbours. Why is that so successful? Absolutely. It's been successful because we've got a really broad spectrum of experience in the workplace here and um, we'd be fools not to tap into that. So we have our mentoring programs, make sure that we've never got people working alone, they're always in pairs and where it can be structured it'll be somebody of greater experience working with somebody of lesser experience. When it all comes together it's a pretty good place to work. Oh, absolutely, it's terrific, yeah. Hi, my name is Mario Pitanella and I'd like to welcome you to Rig 175, my rig, my family. The happy memories with Rig 175 would be uh, the way people have got on together, great camaraderie and working together to achieve a good safe outcome at the end of the day. We all get on with each other, we're a team. It's been a big learning curve for us all, it's been about developing that culture on the rig that we've strived so hard to do. That's been our biggest challenge, forming that single team of, of people. Teamwork on Rig 175 is second to none. We all work together for two weeks at a time, 12 hours a day, seven days a week. That would show through our performance and our deadlines that we made and records we broke, so teamwork was everything. You couldn't get a better bunch of blokes. Rig 175, friendships, on and off the rig. All the guys have been great. They're great to work with. We look after each other, and that's been right from day one. I've made some fantastic friends. I've learned a lot. The guys here, it's a second family. We spent half our life here. Yeah, it's, it's like a big brotherhood. So everyone gets together and chips in, makes the job easier at the end of the day. Big family culture. It's excellent, great place to work. The crews get along really well together. It's a very enjoyable place to work actually. The food's good, the quarters are good, the showers are hot, it's the main thing. Culture wise, it's great. It's like being with all your footy mates or whatever, but going to work for two weeks. Good blokes, good everything. Rig 175 is one of the best rigs getting around for safety, just with their work ethic. Everyone's willing to help out each other. They couldn't do enough for you, and they always look out for one another, which has made it quite enjoyable to work out there. This is our family here. Perko, Gordon, you know, families means a lot. It means closeness and looking after each other.